Like last year, I was just literally Googling uh, youth expeditions. <laughs> I was bored. I really was tired of COVID and I always wanted to do something. Did a lot of research and eventually came across the British Exploring Society. And I thought, yeah, this is what I want to do. It was excited for an opportunity kind of get into a completely different environment that I've been in before. Again, I have no idea where Kyrgyzstan was, so I was like, okay. I think my first thoughts were just, what? <laughs> How are you even able to do this? Expedition has been crazy. Um, I can't believe really that it's almost five weeks are up. It feels like we've been out here forever, but also for no time at all. You, you get you get to like the end of the trip and you're just like, whoa. <laughs> yeah. It makes every day feel like a long time because it's great, but you just, because you're doing so much. It's also very fun. So it yeah. goes really quickly as well as taking a really long time. It's very difficult to explain. <laughs> just looking forward to every day really and something new every day um, which is the most exciting thing. It's so difficult to choose a favourite experience. One would definitely be the pizza oven. You know what that ridge day the, that was tough the one oh yeah the emerald ridge so Karen like like 15 to 20 kilos in every bag. And that was a tough day, but that was an, just an awesome experience. Well, I mean, we've kind of managed to summit some peaks and stuff, and that's just been um, incredible. I think the moments where we've seen a bit of the Kirk's culture. We were invited into a yurt um, to meet a local couple. We tried some of their food, and we actually slept in the yurt overnight as well, which was amazing and unexpected and I think that is definitely a moment and an experience that will stay with me forever. And one of my other favourite moments was going to the uh, Coltor Lake and going for a quick swim in there. I did a bunch of camera work running about with a boom. Different drawing, painting techniques, uh, photography and I have managed to take some nice photos compared to what I could do before. We've done some kick sampling which I hadn't done before to look at sort of the river ecology. I've learned so much about rocks and I uh, learned a bit of Russian. I definitely learned some basic kind of camp craft skills um, while camping which I hadn't done much of. I think I'm more optimistic about what I can do. Um, after sort of pushing my boundaries here. I feel a lot more confident in my, in my physical ability to, to hike about. And it is tough, um, but you've always got a kind of a group of your fire around you, your team, who are always there to support you and encourage you. Yeah, I feel like an adventure and the outdoors and the wilderness and nature can definitely have a massive impact um, on your life, uh, but you've got to be given the opportunity to have that experience about being in nature and doing something you've never done before and being the person to lead your experience. Yeah, definitely go on expedition. You learn so much and you grow so much as a person, so yeah, do it.